Hello, hello, Pisces, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, we are going to be exploring where are you in life, love, and money. Please, universal energy, spirit guides. I don't do reversals. Please bring forward one more message for Pisces. Sun, moon, okay, here we go. Pisces, you start off the reading with the King of Swords. You're making a decision and you're making it now. Okay, whatever you say, it's what's going to go. You are making a head over heart decision. Okay, um, being a, a little cold about it, maybe being cold with someone. You also have here the Emperor, which is the teacher. Okay, so for some of you in the past, you could have been dealing or you were the controlling person. You know, um, somebody who thinks it's their way or the highway, you know, it is, this is what needs to be done. <laughs> okay. Um, you also have here the six of cups, which is, um, a possible reunion. Okay. Or you looking for a possible reunion, looking toward the past, thinking about when things were good, you know, and somehow feeling like what happened, you know? Why is the King of Swords here for Pisces? Please, Universal Energies. Ooh, karmic. Some of you made a decision to move away or made a decision about a temptation that you were in. With the Devil Energy, it is always kind of a little sinful. It is, you know, Devil Energy. Listen, it is listening to the Devil in your ear. You also have here the Queen of Swords. So somebody here, listen, I can't help but feel that there, if you are hooked up with somebody, you and this person are pissed off at each other pissed off you know this is a woman who's been scorned this is a woman who who is making logical decisions not through her heart because now she is cold you know some of you are really looking into um, gaining some strength okay feeling as if though you have this in the bag I just want to show you the king and the queen of swords. They're not even looking at each other, okay? These are two people that give their backs and will ignore whatever is in front of them. No longer wanting to deal. They're just being logical about the situation. Um, why is the emperor here? Why is the emperor here for Pisces? Please, universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. Why is Pisces... Oh my God, I'm getting stuck. Um, Emperor, Three of Cups, okay, so there was a third party situation in the past, okay, um, and I can't help but feel that some of you are dealing with, this could be either you or your significant other, there is another queen here, um, so keep in mind that gender really doesn't matter, it could be a king as well, this is a person that um, makes their money, is very independent as well, okay, uh, why is the Six of Cups here? Six of Cups. Why is it here for Pisces? Six of Cups. Six of Cups. These universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. Please bring forward. Why is the Six of Cups here? Six of Cups. Six of Cups. Hermit. Okay, so there's somebody here who is not happy and you're healing. I get the feeling that because you walked away from a situation or because you are trying to find a, you're trying to find a way how to get back to what you had. Um, with the hermit here, some of you may be healing from a situation, kind of withdrawn from a situation as well. With the four of cups here, you're, you're looking at the cups that have spilled, okay? And you are going to miss the opportunity to eat that, that is flying over your head because you are still hoping that these three cups had not spilled. Okay? This is third-party situation. So usually what happens is that all the investments that you put into your relationship tend to spill when you um, bring somebody else into the equation. I just saw 444. Four, four. Please, universal energies. Okay, so waiting for a message to come in before you proceed, okay? Why is the devil energy here? 
going back to the devil energy. Why is it here? Listen, you, ha you have to find your own strength not to listen to the demonic energy. Why is the devil here? Okay. Seven of Swords. Okay, so lies, deceptions, whatever, wh whatever the situation was, um, it fell apart because there was somebody here that was holding secrets, holding lies, holding deceptions, okay? Being very sneaky and dishonest, you know? So this could be you, this could be the other person. However, like I said, you are pissed the fuck off at this other person. And then there's somebody here who's just working on her money. You know, with the Queen of Pentacles. So in your present, in your present, there you're pissed off with somebody. Keep in mind that, you know, energies can be reversed. I may be talking to, about multiple people. So, why is the Four of Cups here? Four of Cups. The Emperor. So you get this twice. So some of you are dealing with somebody that's controlling. Okay, that's controlling. They say it's their way or the highway. This could also be you, your way or the highway. You know, this is somebody who places boundaries, gives orders. It's very controlling and manipulative. There's a lot of cold energy here. There's not too much love in this reading. You know, you got swords galore. Please universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. Why is the seven of swords here? Last card, Seven of Swords. Why is it here? Seven of Swords. Three of Pentacles. Third party. Here we go. Third party, okay? Third party. Somebody here was very sneaky about this third party. This could have been a situation that happens at work, okay? But there is some sneaky behavior here. There is some dishonesty. And for some reason, I just feel that some of you are really wanting to step forward um, in your previous connection because I do feel that even though the cups have been spilled, you're still looking out for that hope. Okay, thank you so much for being here and Pisces, take care.